Hey guys, today I have a large haul from Joann's, from Michael's, and from Hobby Lobby. And some were online purchases, some I picked up in the store yesterday, and I've tried to keep everything separated, so apologies if I get something mixed up. I, I tried to keep everything together. So I'll start out with Joann's. I, I kept seeing a bunch of people doing hauls on Joann's and I said, well, you know, I gotta go to the store. So I had, they had sent me a 50% off and a 40% off a regular price item. And then they had a coupon that was $15 off 75 and then it reduced down like $10 off 50 and $5 off 35 I think is how it went. So I wound up using the 50 the 40% off, and the $15 off. So that was in store. <clears throat> so this is what I picked up. They actually had uh, a very small display of the Sizzix Thimlets from Tim Holtz. So I picked up these, what's the name of these? Toil and Trouble. And I, I love her. I absolutely love the cats and I love the cauldron. I'm not real crazy about that, but I figured that could be snipped off. And she's cute, but maybe we could tweak her so she doesn't look so clumsy on that spoon. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. But I really like the stance she was in. So I picked that up. I picked up this one. This one, I got 40% off this one. This one was 50% off. My goodness, this is an expensive die because it's a colorize. And if you have never bought a colorize, just be forewarned. It's a lot of piecing together. Like if you look, look at all these pieces. Watch a video on it, Sizzix.com or just Sizzix on YouTube. They will have a video where it's kind of computer generated. It's really quick. It kind of shows you all the pieces. But... I can never find cute little Frankenstein monsters. I just have the hardest time finding little Frankenstein monsters. And I find vampires very hard to find as well. So I'm rolling the dice and got to try my hand at this because I think he's just so cute. I just loved him so much. So I grabbed that. And then I was the other day I was needing a spider web and couldn't find a die. And this one I did pay full price for, but I think this one was around like $12.99. And, you know, they gave me two on sale, so I was fine with that. So I picked that, those up. Very excited about those. And then I picked up Halloween Party. Now, online, this stuff is all on sale. In the store, it is all regular price. So I find the shopping very confusing when I go in store. But I didn't see this online. I may have missed it. But <laughs> it's a little bad. Look at his face. He's really cute. The ghost is sweet. The pumpkin, the the little tombstone. Look at the little skull. And I'm not super crazy about skulls unless they're sweet and then I love them. Cute kitty. The witch, she needs to go to a hairdresser. We might be able to fix that up a little bit, but I think she's meant to be cutesy. And look, a die. Like, that shocked me. I thought that was amazing seems like these were $6.99, so they, they were not an unreasonable price. And I love a hearse. I think a hearse is so funny. And last year, one of the, I, don't, I think it was Simple Stories, it could have been Echo Park, they had a hearse in their paper, and I loved it. I just thought it was the cutest idea. So, unfortunately, the hearse doesn't have the die. The house got the die. But I do have a scan and cut, which sometimes I can get to do what I want it to do. So I bought him. He's funny. I feel like you could kind of wipe him off and not even use that little Grim Reaper that's inside. But so I picked up these two. And then I picked up, they had all of their paper all their specialty paper, and these were all wrapped in plastic. I, I just took them out. Uh, I I wanted to try this pink. I thought this was pretty, and I have a really hard time finding pinks I like in glitter. So I grabbed this, and like I said, these were all, they're all individually wrapped, 
and they were all 50% off. I grabbed this gold. It has kind of a basket weave or a linen, more like a linen texture to it. I grabbed this gorgeous sparkle glitter. This is just acetate, but I thought, oh, that might make a nice shaker for Halloween. And it seems like all of these papers were $2 and something. So I paid a, a, a dollar something for them. So it wasn't, it was reasonable. This is um, iridescent. And I thought, well, I have to have that because it's showing iridescent pink. I picked up two just because I thought it was fantastic. Those were all of the papers that I looked at. I was actually kind of tired. The beads were on sale 30% off. I mean, not 30% off, 60% off. I only picked up a few because they're, they're, it was all their Hildy and Joe strung beads. Their, their beads are very expensive. It seems like it was like $5.99 and $7.99. I, oh, I did pick up a few more. I just happened to put these. I'll grab the other ones I picked up. So I picked up these butterflies because I, thought, I just thought they were really pretty and I love butterflies and I need to start working more butterflies into my, into my work. And I, I love these. I thought these were so pretty. These they look to me like they're wire wrapped. I will cut one off and see, but I saw these and thought, oh my gosh, these look wire wrapped right here. Oh my gosh, if they're wire wrapped, yes, I want every color I can find. So I found the clear and it looks like a crystal clear. It's not, yeah, it's a crystal clear. And I found the pink. Oh, isn't that beautiful? And the pink and I found black. There was a purple. I saw it and then I couldn't, the purple I saw first and I thought, oh, I don't really think I'd use this, but that's really cool. Look, let me look for some other colors, but I found black. So I, I just couldn't find it again. So I picked up these three and let's just snip. Let's snip this or open this and see. just see what see if these indeed are wire wrapped I think I am going to have to snip it and I didn't have many black beads so I wanted some black beads oh my gosh they are that is so fantastic. So they're already ready to hang and they're teeny, teeny, tiny. And I, I'm not the best at, at doing these little loops. So technically they're not wire wrap, but they are, it's a double loop. That, that's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. I'm thrilled with that. Oh, let's see, you guys can see it. There. Isn't that, isn't that nice? They're already done for us. Okay. So there's that. Get that in focus. Okay. So I will move these out of the way. Okay. These are from the strung beads that were on sale. And I thought, oh my gosh, these are perfect for Christmas. There was one of these. There was one of these and there was one of these. I mean, I, they look like Christmas balls. They're the same metal of a Christmas ball. And they are clear on the inside. They are absolutely stunning, and I just absolutely love them. Look at that. And then these are definitely wire wrapped. How fancy. Look, someone would think you are a master at this. You hang this from a project. 
just gorgeous. So these were all the beads that I picked up. I just, there were so many. It was actually the third store I had hit. I started with Hobby Lobby. Wait, yeah, I started with Hobby Lobby. I went to Michael's and then I went to Joann's and then it was like, I got, I have to go because my daughter's gonna be home from school soon. So I think that's a beautiful haul, a beautiful bead haul. So we'll put these out of the way. I might have to move these. I'll move this. This, this came, this I purchased from Joanne online in the store. These were regular priced at $3. Online, they were like a dollar or a dollar and a few cents. That's why I tried them out because I thought, ooh, these look, you know, these are cute. They're small, they'd be cute for Happy Mail. I've seen people decorate them and in Happy Mail you don't you know you don't want to send too huge of stuff because you got to get it in a box and I liked the pink I thought that would work for Christmas and for Halloween so there's that little storage tin and then this I, have, I wish I had a piece of white paper but these are super cute I'm trying to see it okay those show show up okay these are super cute they're actually a little raised, a little. They're like a vellum sticker. And I took them out of the package without thinking, but they pull right up with all of the Halloween papers. That's, that's how I find them. I didn't go hunting for these. They just pulled right up as a recommendation. So I'll show this. So everybody has been making the cute little cotton candies and they use little paper cones or they use beads. And I'm like, what are they using? And I figured out it was craft fluff. This is the only craft fluff I could find, this yellow. But I think the yellow might be cute. If I get around to it, it would be cute for Halloween cotton candy. Cause you could do, you know, black and white and orange and yellow and it could kind of be candy corn like. So I grabbed this, oh, and it's cheap too. It's like <clears throat> $2. And I ordered that online. I, I didn't find that at the store, but the store, my Joann's, was very barren of things. And I was so happy that I had picked up what I had picked up online because there just wasn't much to choose from. So I picked these up, all that bling. I liked them because they were black and they're Jolie's Boutique. I thought these would be great for Halloween. I wanted some, and everything was on sale. I wanted some some orange, so I like these by Park Lane. They were all on sale. They were either half price or a dollar. They were all on sale. Everything was very reasonable, and you get all three sizes. And they're self-adhesive. I picked up this foam board because I have been buying so much ribbon from AliExpress and I thought, you know what, I need to be able to keep it in like one of my storage cubes. And I thought I could cut and maybe put two or three amount, you know, roll them up and keep them organized. And I bought safety pins for that too. And they are in the box over here. So we'll get to that in a minute. So. I picked up some, let's see, tool, and I picked up, this says it's 10 yards. It looks so tiny, but it says it's 10 yards. This is this one. Oh, this one's 25 yards. This was a foil dot, and this is, this just says glimmer, so it's very pretty. I picked up, because I've been watching everybody, and I think if you guys want this stuff, I think there's a chance our stores aren't getting it. I, I could be wrong, but it's not September yet, but my fear was they were going to sell out online, and my stores were either never going to get it, or they were only going to get a couple. Like, when I looked at the dies at Joann's, there was like two of each die, or one of each die, and then empty hang tags and I thought yikes this is not a lot of stock so anyways I love this one this this um 
metallic purple kind of cobweb tool and it's purple this one I am on the fence about <laughs> this one is very very silver like that's a lot of silver which I like black and silver together but that's a lot of silver and again all this stuff was on sale 30 percent off but not at all in the store this I absolutely love I picked up some what did they call I think they called it eyelash trim place and time oh this one was expensive $10.99 but it was on sale and I haven't seen this it's a very it has a very thick trim piece on it and I just like that I thought you could really manipulate it well so I grabbed that and I I love fluffy stuff like that now these were unique these were from pop and it's a foam shaped spider web I didn't expect these to be this large I really didn't expect these to be this large let me get a, a ruler now I have my trusty little ruler right here almost 11 inches that's that's big so that could make a very nice I mean I could really decorate that up and they were it says they were two forty nine um and then thirty percent off now I'll keep going you guys know I love my molds, so I picked these up these were four ninety nine they were all on sale too, and I picked up pumpkins I can even see them better this way picked up tombstones and then I picked up these bottles how cool is that it doesn't say what it is i don't think but they're by it they're by wilton and they just are place and time so loving those <clears throat> grab these these were buy one get one free and my daughter wanted one of these she wanted the ice cream and the popsicle and I thought, well, let me pick out a free one. And so I picked out seashells because I love seashells and I thought resin seashells might be really nice. So I'll, I've got more ribbon and a ribbon that I hadn't seen other people haul. I absolutely love plaid. Oh my gosh, I love plaid. And this is even prettier in person than it was on the website. And I had not seen anybody get the Ouija board. And I don't typically decorate with Ouija board stuff, but I thought this was really cool looking. Just very subtle, adds a nice touch. Love it. And this pumpkin. So they have a bunch of boxes and I picked up one. Like my store had one of each box in the small and medium and then a couple in the large and a few more in the extra large and that was it. You could tell it was all out. It just, it, it's strange to me how low the stock is. And I know it has to do with the past year and retail struggling a little bit, but get it, get it while it's online. I mean, I'd rather pay a few dollars more and get something than miss out on it. So, I mean, that's my opinion. So this, when it came, I was like, oh my gosh, I love this. So it, I knew it had a wired edge, but I did not realize it had a shiny black trim on it. So that's really cool. So I'll put it down here where it focuses better. And this is a, these are thicker. These are thicker. Does it say two and a half inches and you get four yards. And I thought that was, these were nice pumpkins. Then I picked up just this ribbon. It's a, what do you call it? It, it is a, like a twine. It's a braided, it's a braided ribbon. I thought it was going to be metallic and soft, but it's, I mean, metallic and hard. It's actually soft and a little shiny, but not metallic. It, it's very nice. Very nice. That could work for Thanksgiving and fall. So I picked up 
this. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of ribbon. I picked up this, and it's one and a half inches. And this, oh my gosh, this is going to be absolutely perfect. It's like a black spider web. How amazing is that? I picked up two of these, I, at least two. I may have gone crazy and bought three. But, but all the ribbon was on sale. This is, this one's Offray. This one, I, I may have picked it up at Joanne. I may have picked it up at Hobby Lobby. I think I picked it up at Joanne. It was either Joanne or Hobby Lobby. I didn't buy anything from Michaels. They just didn't, their stock was so low and nothing was on sale. But this is the same type of, it is spider webby white. Yeah, I think I picked it up online. Let's see if there's a, not really an item number or anything to offer. If for some reason someone can't find this, just leave it in the comments and I will find at least an item number in the store where it came from. But I'm pretty sure it came from Joann's online. Okay, so we got the white, we have the black. Then I picked up orange tinsel. And I, when I find tinsel, it's one fifth of an inch. When I find tinsel, I go crazy because I love tinsel. And this is not wired, it's, um, it's ribbon, like it's a uh, fabric. So that's so much easier to work with than the wire. This one is the kind of like a weathered canvas. Let's see how many inches this is. One and a half inches. And I love it. It's, um, It's not solid orange. It has kind of, I don't, because it's canvas, the dye didn't take in all the lines. So it's, it's kind of, you can see the texture. It's beautiful. And it has that shiny black trim on it like this one does. So love that. more of the black let's see have I shown this one this one's a little different yeah this one's a little different oh this is this is stiff this one is flexible so this one's flexible isn't that cool so you could do big ribbons. You could squish it down and do small ribbons. This one, I think, is the one I picked up two of. So, and it's a black tinsel. And it, it's on wire. It's a very, very thin gauge wire. This one is one and a half inches wide. And it has the teeny tiniest little pom-poms. The teeny tiniest little pom-poms. And I think it's a pretty true orange. It's a bright orange. It's a very Halloween orange. I love it. It's like, this is more of a pumpkin orange. This is more of a crayon orange, maybe. I love it. Okay, now this one, I thought I was going to absolutely love this one. It's supposed to be purple two and a half inches. It, this looks, it's a, it's the darkest purple I've ever seen. So in this, at this angle, it looks purple, but I, this is a very dark ribbon. It's pretty, but not one of my favorites, not considering all this other goodness. I'm still glad I picked it up. This, <clears throat> I could put this on my lamp post. I could wrap a package in it. It, it would be great. But it doesn't, it's not as, it's too dark of a purple for me. Then this I loved because it's like a bluish green. And I know that's in one of the Simple Stories paper packs that I ordered. So I had to get this. And it's itchy, 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 bitty pom-poms strung. Maybe a quarter of an inch apart. So cute. And Oh, this is more of that stretchy ribbon. This is more of this. A few more. And a 
little more tool. So I picked up more of this orange tinsel. And then this is the stretchy ribbon. This is the one I picked up three of. I wish I had have picked up another one of these. That's fantastic too. But this will do the same effect. That's fantastic. I love that. <clears throat> well, I love it as a black and a white, even though they're different brands. I grabbed Glimmer Tool. And this is like a light blue. And then I grabbed matte white tool because I just thought you kind of always need white tool. And the plan is to make rosettes. I have enough stuff. I should be able to make things for years with all this. I grabbed this just because it was purple sequins. And I liked the big, I grabbed this online. It has the cats. It has skulls. And it has these big purple circles in it. And I thought that was, oh, they're moons. It, it, I thought that was really cool. Really, really cool. So, $2.99 and 30% off. It's not as much as you get from AliExpress, but it's a nice combination. There's skull and crossbones. It's cute. I like it. I'll go ahead and put that with my sequins right now. I grabbed some of this Color Pour resin. This was on sale. This was on sale in the store as well. I think it was 30% off. But I wanted some of these flakes and I loved how they came in these tiny little containers so organized. And I just didn't think you would really need much for resin. So I grabbed that. And I grabbed some little bobbins because I always need bobbins. Now, there may be more from Joanne. Okay, so here are the boxes from Joanne I was talking about. And this one was $9.99, but it was 30% off. 8.3 inches by 3.5 inches by 3.5 inches. Okay, is how cool is that? Is that not, don't you just love that? Would that? Could you not just put the coolest gift or keep store your little favorite supplies in this? I loved it. I, I, trying to think if I even saw this one. I saw a skinny one that was small like this in the store, and there was one of it. It must have been this one, but online there's an absolute ton of these to choose from. In the store, it was just a handful, just a handful of designs. So that's probably a pretty easy thing for them to ship. I grabbed this little storage case because this was on sale at like half price and I don't have any of these small let's see if you can see them better these smaller containers and I thought oh you know even if I don't use this this would be good for happy mail and they're all stored right inside this container and I picked up these were on sale I picked these up at the store I think they were half price I think these came from, did these come from Joanne or did these come from Hobby Lobby? Hmm. I think these came from Joanne. Wait. No, I think these came from Hobby Lobby. And uh, just safety pins, because I figured if I start wrapping ribbon, around this foam board I'm going to need to secure it some way and I thought safety pins would work so I got the variety pack okay and then here this is Joanne's the Halloween party I ordered this online and I'm glad because it was on sale online and it was not on sale in the store and there was a price checker in my store that I was scanning I scanned a few things and just thought this is crazy why is it online a cheaper price than in the store but so I'm I know everybody has gone through these and shown all these designs sorry about that so I won't take the time to go through it we can just kind of oh so cute because I haven't even looked at it there's the witch with her crazy hair oh little candies and skulls and candy corns the cat Oh, that's pretty. The silver iridescent. Oh, 
I like the back side. The back side of that. Those are cute. It's funny. All this stuff came in and I'm trying to get it organized. They are darling. And he's in the stamp set. This I love. Eep. Cute. Cute. Oh, I always love words. And I love these pumpkins. I keep seeing people haul stickers from the Dollar Tree. And the pumpkins look very similar to this. These are pretty. Oh, I oh my gosh. I always love a good spider web. It's just such a great background design. And I always love pumpkins. It's just really nice paper. So this is the die cuts with a view. The bats on that side. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love that. And I can't believe I haven't gotten any of my pre-ordered papers yet. But I'm still waiting on them. I believe this is the last from... This is the last from Joanne. And this was open. Like... I don't think it adhered in production. So, oh my gosh, are these, these, that's why I bought this because it said they were iridescent with holographic foil. And I couldn't believe that a six by six had holographic foil. So, and I don't, I don't typically buy the smaller ones, but I need to start doing that. Oh my gosh. Each side, that side is just as good as this side. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Oh, I love this. Some of these are different than the big pad. I love the bats. Sorry that's doing that. Such a stiff. It's so little. Oh my gosh, here, look at that. Oh, and that is beautiful. What's on the other side of this? <gasps> Little circles, black and white circles. See, I would probably save that for this side. This one has stars. Oh my gosh, the ghosts. I don't know how I'm going to possibly be able to use all of this stuff, but my stash is set and I'm thrilled. I am thrilled with this paper. They really did a great job with this. Okay. So, I will show my hot what came from Hobby Lobby. And then I will kind of tidy this up and come back with what I picked up from Michaels cuz the Hobby Lobby haul was very small. So, I had been wanting this leather ribbon and or faux leather ribbon and it was over it was over with the ribbon over in the sewing department and I don't I don't ever go where the fabric and the sewing notions are in Hobby Lobby I just I get so distracted when you go in the front of the store with all the holiday stuff I never make it to the back but look I was looking for this color and then I saw this color so I grabbed them both so I this I think this is a light pink and then this is like kind of a shocking pink. So, love those. And they were half price. These were half price. And this was the only set of these bubblegum beads that I was not able to get my hands on. So now I've got these purples and the purple and white stripe and the mint green and white polka dot and these disco ball looking pink ones. So, and then these rhinestone ones, but these disco ball ones, I've been dying to get my hands on. Now, this, I don't know why this came off of it, but this is Gilt Eyelash. And I knew I had the, this was I think 30% off, 40% off. I knew I had the eyelash trim, which was here coming. So I didn't buy two of these. Because this was, I thought this was expensive. It was, I think, $6.99. Yeah. 
it was 30 percent off and i thought you know what i i need to get this because i think this will look great with halloween and with christmas and look how much you get 111 yards so this will last for a while love this my colors were so pretty when i went to the register at hobby lobby the pinks and the iridescents and then this is the only other stuff I got. I grabbed, um, let's see, this wide glitter ribbon, two and a half inches wide, and then this one and a half inch wide. Now this is a solid, very chunky glitter ribbon. I don't have anything like this. Absolutely love it. I, I just, I have plans for that. I'm so excited. And this one is more of a mesh lace so and it's got glitter and it's iridescent look at that isn't that pretty so it's different than this because this could be used really all year all year round I feel like this one is a little more can you even see my hand this one <laughs> I feel like this one's a little more Halloweenish, and this one's just a little more glamorous so all right now this this I grabbed because I couldn't find, what was I looking for? Seam binding. I wanted some white seam binding and I wanted to dye it myself. None of the three stores I went in had seam binding. But at, what store was I at? I think it was Hobby Lobby. Who's this by? I'm pretty sure it was Hobby Lobby. Um the girl called her manager and her manager said, now you can dye this stuff. So we'll see. It's a little thicker than I wanted. What is it called? Twill tape. I feel like it could be trimmed, but I'm, I'm going to try to dye it with my Delusions ink and see if I can get some good colors out of it. This is a to-do project in the future and how much do you get three yards for 249 and it was 50 percent off i mean i really was like okay <laughs> i'll try it so i will pause and grab my items put these away and then grab my items from michael's okay so i'm back with what i picked up at michaels.com i did not pick up anything in the store it was just so bare uh, I you know and I've heard other people say I don't know what's going on I don't either I'm I'm thinking the stock's just not gonna be there this year so I grabbed these because I thought these would be cute to do wands and then they came and they were so darling I kept them in the little package and we might actually use them as straws a little kitty a little pumpkin little moon eyes um, some bats he's peeking back there and then some ghosts so cute these so this I wanted to show you so I picked up some streamers for some rosettes and I've been kind of playing around with my crepe paper and you know just kind of throwing it in the sewing machine trying to make little rosettes here's a couple little rosettes I played with you just um, you know just just trying to kind of spark some inspiration. Um, this is the size of the Michaels. Um, you know, if you buy it full price, it seems like it's around four or five dollars. This is the size of the Target. I already had the Target. I didn't realize I had a black. I think two ninety nine at Target, five dollars at Michaels. Um, that's here. I'll do it this way so you can see it. That's a crazy difference. That is a crazy difference. This might be a smidge wider than this, but oh my goodness, you get so, so much more from Target, just so you know. So there, but uh, they didn't have purple at Target. You know, some colors you just can't find. I don't think they had orange at Target or at Michael's. Like, I'm, I don't have orange crepe paper. That just occurred to me. Oh my gosh. 
more stuff. Okay, so these were at Michael's. Wait, hold on. Is it Michael's? Yes. So these were in a pack where you get two of each, and I just separated them and put them all together. These kitty cats I thought were so pretty, and the little eyes pop out. So you can pop the little eyes out. And I just, when they came in, it was the first thing to come in. And I said, ooh, let me try to make something. It's cute, right? Right? You can't really put it on top of the pumpkin. Now, you could use the pumpkin as a base and do some other stuff. You know, cover it around. But, you know, that, that you could do something with. That looks good. But I liked these. I bought two packs of them. And I kind of wish I had bought more. I love these. And I love cats. So what I did was I just cut a circle out of, it wasn't orange. It's more of a golden orange sheet of cardstock, glitter cardstock. I put some purple behind the kitty cat's eyes. And then I just hot glued it together. I put some foam. And I used the Dollar, Store, the Dollar Tree foam. <sighs> I don't really know if I like it. It's not very thick. It is crazy sticky. Like I, I see people, they just love their Dollar Tree foam. I don't think it's up high enough. Now I, I could have doubled it up. But like I said, it's really sticky. So I don't know that I'll buy any more of that, but you know, it's nice to have if you run out. So there's that little cutie that's ready for something. I picked up these treat bags, and I should put those in there so I don't lose them. And I thought they were really, really, really cute for kids. Really cute. So I got those, and I grabbed these. Look at these for Christmas. And they have the little zip top. Love that. So I am already starting with Christmas, and I have I am set for Halloween. So, next we'll go through the box, see what all I've got. So, Michael's had this, I don't know, I think it was buy one, get one, half price. It was on sale. Well, I, there, were, there was some sort of sale. And I picked up the, this iridescent, like, silvery, and then the red. Does it say what it is? Red foil. And holographic foil. So I picked those up just because Christmas, Halloween, this could also be used for Christmas. So I've got a whole pack of that. Look at that, 25 sheets. It's a reasonable price. This, this is Joanne. This, I got this mixed up. This is right, this one right here is Joanne because this is place and time. So this is the coolest treat bag. Look, at it's an iridescent orange. So it almost has a pinkish hue to the spider web. It's gorgeous. And then this, it's just a little hocus pocus. I wanted to buy multiples of these, but um, I thought they were kind of expensive. And this, I think in the store was 30% off, but uh, I, I don't know. I, I was having a hard time in Joanne. They didn't have much signage. They didn't have much stuff out. It was kind of confusing. So that got mixed up in here. I believe I picked this up at Joanne too. These glitter flakes, crystal iris. Is that not the coolest thing? I thought these could be glued down, would make nice little additions to like sparkly elements on a project. Sorry, I got that mixed up, but these are definitely Joanne. This is from Joanne's. They had, I mean, I bought a lot at Joanne's and with all those coupons, I did not spend near what I thought I was going to. I saved, I saved a ton at Joanne's with those coupons, but I needed a... USB cable. I'm actually using it right here on my video because I needed one for down in my craft room. And now I have one for my suitcase because it was buy one, get one free and they were $14.99. The last USB cable I bought was $12.99 from Target and it wasn't this 
braided material. It was just plastic. This is a really nice, this is a really nice cord. They had them up by the registers. You know how you go through the herd line before you get to the registers? So it's kind of like all those little odds and ends that you grab while you're waiting. They had it for Android and iPhone. So make sure you grab the right one. All right, I'm almost positive this is Michael's. <laughs> okay, so I picked these guys up. I must have only picked up three. They, like I said, they were on sale, 30% off. But I just look at them. They're so, they're, to me, they're the perfect jack o' lantern face. They're happy. Their, their lines are perfect. And I thought these would be beautiful in a rosette, beautiful on projects. I mean, just, they were just perfect. And I, I like the thought of not getting them was upsetting to me. <laughs> so I went ahead and picked up three. So I have them. And then, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This cat, right? Look at these, like, that's a cute skull on a happy little jack-o'-lantern with a funny little crow and a sweet little ghost and the house, the spooky and the boo. I just, I, I, it's hard to find a good cat and I love this cat. So I got this. I think I got another one. Might, maybe not, maybe not another. I picked up, I know I picked up two of these and these not only are ephemera, they're stickers. Like, I, I was shocked at that. So there's the price and then 30% off. So you get bats. Look at, look at that, a pumpkin with bat wings. The happy haunting I loved. That's a little bit different of a cat than that one, even though I think these are supposed to go together. But it it's similar. I love that cat. It looks like you get some glitter. He might be glitter. Spider web, spider, trick or treat, more bats and more ghosts. This was good. I am so, look at that. They're sticker backed. That's amazing. Amazing. Love that. Yes, here is the other package I bought of that. Cause I, I, I mean, I just thought my store doesn't have any of this yet. And when they do get it, it'll probably be a week that I'm too busy to go. So just go ahead and get it. And these I picked up corsage pins just in case. My ribbon idea doesn't work with safety pins and I need corsage pins, but I'm hoping my safety pin idea works. Now, these are fantastic. I wish I had a bought more. These are die cut shapes. They are glitter bats. How many do you get? Oh, you get 12 pieces. That's a good amount. You could make the most fantastic garland with this bat. So $4.99 and 30% off. And as the days go by, you know, 40% is going to hit. I think once 50% hits, I think they'll sell out. So just keep your eye on. They had glitter on sale. This one is crazy looking. I don't know what's going on there. Okay, so they had, I needed some extra fine white glitter. And then I picked up this orange it is as bright as it looks. I hope it's coming across neon orange. I mean, it's like a safety vest orange. It's bright, but I really like it. And I think it would be really cool in resin. I think it would make a really bright resin. So happy with these and they were on sale. So I got really lucky shopping online with things on sale. Okay. These are bead landing. So we know that's Michael's. And these are, I think they're only online. I, I don't know. But these were on sale for a dollar and change from $3.99. And the way I view like the $3.99, because they put stuff 50% off and 40% off, I usually in my head, I cut it in half. And I say, well, if it's $4 and they mark it down on clearance to $2, I'm not really getting that great of a deal. I'm getting it at a normal price. When they mark it down a dish more than half off, I know, hey, I'm getting a good deal. And my thought behind this was 
the wood beads can be painted. So if I don't have a certain color I need for a project for whatever season, I've got tons of acrylic paint. I can paint these, I can use them plain wood, and by the time I painted it and it dried, I wouldn't even be at the store. So I'm, that's my thought, that I have some spare beads I can change the colors of. And these were just an unusual shape, and they were a dollar, and I thought if I saw this at the dollar store, I'd buy it. So I thought I'd try these out, paint a few of those, see how they look. And then this one, they were these round, flat. And I thought these are so neat. I really like these. And I've seen on AliExpress some really pretty expensive beads this shape and wondered, should I, shouldn't I? So I thought, why not get a few, paint a few, see if I can decorate them somehow and use them in a project, then bite the bullet and buy the more expensive, fancy ones if I like it, or save myself some money because I didn't buy the fancy ones. Okay, now this I know came from Joanne because I picked this up by the register. I walked all around all by the glues, all by the adhesives, all around looking for hot glue sticks. And I found these. They were by the register. They were underneath these cell phone things. And I just thought, this is like all your hot glue. And you've got it by the registers in the herd line. That's crazy to me. And the glue aisle was sparse. But yet this was, I don't know what's going on with the stores. But... I got plenty of hot glue and I like the really long ones. They had a choice of where you could get them where they were half the size. I just really like, I like not having to change them at all. And this came, this is from michaels.com. And apparently these click together. Look at that, it's cool. So you could have a tower of glitter. Is this not so pretty? This ultra fine, is it ultra fine or just, just assorted glitter? It looks ultra fine on this side and then chunky on this side. And I, I just, I love it. I love the pink. So I'm, I'm really set with my supplies right now. I grabbed one more tool online. I, I wound up really wanting to get the chunky pink. I just thought it would add something to Halloween and Christmas. So I got the chunky glitter tool in pink and all all the stuff everything was on sale so happy these were I think it was buy one get one free that's why I got two some six by six acetate sheets and then it occurred to me wow we could make six by six shakers what are we gonna put six by six shakers on that could be a fun thing to play with right okay so you get 12 pieces so between the two, 24 pieces. I don't think it says the price, but I think it was around like $6. Like, so that was a good price. And this came, and I'm trying to think when I was in Michael's, they did not have this. Joanne had their papers, because remember I picked up the stamps. Joanne had much better stock than Michael's. But don't look for anybody to help you find anything because they are not available. Okay, so in any stores, except Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby was like, I bought the least from them and got received the best service. So anyways, so I picked this up and we'll just go. I know other people have been showing this and it was 30% off of $14.99. And we'll just, so like a marble, that's cool. Oh, look at that. Look at those sweet little pumpkins. Look at his sweet face. I always love this, this mouth, like the stitched look. I love that, look at that sweet little white one. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that's good, that black. Oh yeah, so I knew this was in here. This vellum, oh my gosh, but I had forgotten. That is, phenomenal. So I have, oh, here's some white. Ooh, this would make a cool memory decks card. Look at that. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, I wish I had two of these, but I don't need it. I need to stop buying stuff. Now this trick or treat, you could 
cut this out and you could make a, a sign with that. That's fantastic. You could leave it. You could cut some another circle and pop it on top of that if you didn't want that. Always, always love the busy sheets of paper like this. Always love to use this as my background paper. Oh my gosh, they're darling. So I'm curious. I had that orange ribbon. I don't have it. I don't have it close to me. I moved it to just compare that orange ribbon with the teeny tiny um, dots. I'll try to keep my hand here and grab that and compare. This cat's cute. It looks different though than the cat here. Maybe it's my imagination. It's, it, I mean, it's the same cat, I guess, just because her back's arched and she's so fabulous here. She looks, a, she just looks so sweet here and she looks like she's on guard there. Love it. I love that stamp. So glad that's a stamp. I mean, $5 and 30% off. Oh my gosh, you can't lose with that. I love spider webs. And this is a crinkle. It's an intentional crinkle. What a cool idea. And then flat. And then this is this is raised. Can you see how the embossing on that side? These are raised. They're embossed. And then these darling, I have to do something with that. How cute of a large card would that be? Oh my gosh. You might even be able to do a slimline card from the side with this. They're cute, they're cute, they're cute. And let's see, they match. Look at that, love it. Okay, I have one last thing. Phew, goodness. Oh, too much stuff. I went ahead and grabbed this. It was only, it was only $5.99 and then 30% off. I said, well, I, you always need glitter paper. So got, that's, a, that's kind of a gun metal. Oh my gosh, it's four. This, let me get this open so we can see this. Okay. So this, that just, that is just a plain orange. That is just a plain orange sheet right there. Oh, it looks like there's going to be a plain gray sheet, but it's going to go with this, so... Okay, so we got four orange, four gold. That's a good gold. Oh, four black. I mean, you just don't get better than that for Halloween for me. Then this is a gray. That looks like that would make a good box. And then orange. I have the hardest time finding orange glitter paper for Halloween. So four sheets of that. This will be gone by the end of the season. <laughs> but if you have this, remember you get you get your black and you get your crinkle orange and your regular orange. This is not quite this is very orange. Is that I think it's the same color. S something about the crinkle just makes this orange really pop. But they're the same orange. Maybe not quite as much glitter on this one. Like I, maybe I'm seeing some silver come through on this. And once you start cutting on it, you'll never tell. But this is cool. All right, guys. Let me scan my table. I think that's it. I think that I might need to stop shopping for the season and get to work. So thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.